No, I don't know what we're going to do for cocktail this week. We need to create something totally new. Yes, something unusual. Something exotic. Yes. I don't know, there's a million recipes out there with all kinds of different ingredients. I feel like everything's probably already been tried. Yeah. You know, I once heard about these villages in Peru where a bunch of old ladies would get together and chew on coca leaves and spit into a vat. Uh, said to have healing properties. So maybe we could... No. That's fair. That's too exotic. Sure. I don't know. Maybe we just do something with banana. Welcome, ladies and also gentlemen, to Sip On It and Spin. You know, a wise philosopher once wrote... Time flies like an arrow, fruit flies like a banana. And so do I, particularly when it's smashed into a cocktail. So let's make a banana hanging lounge chair, okay? In order to make this drink, you're gonna need several ingredients, folks. You're gonna need two ounces of white rum. You will need half a banana which you are going to muddle or mash. You also need half an ounce of caramel simple syrup, which we're gonna make over at the stove in just a moment. You also need a dash of cinnamon for a nice topper on your cocktail there. So let us go on over to the stove now to make our caramel simple syrup. Hey there, gang. It's your favorite syrup voiceover guy here to advise you on how to make yet another delicious syrup for your cocktail. Start by putting one cup of white sugar and one quarter cup of water into a nice little pot or saucepan on low heat. Stir it incessantly until the sugar dissolves, which is probably about 10 minutes. Now bring the heat up, cover, and boil for three more of your minutes. All set there? Remove that nifty little pot from the heat. Add another quarter cup of water slowly while stirring. Stir in one teaspoon of vanilla extract and a pinch of kosher salt. Now you can, at long last, stop stirring things. Let your syrup cool and store it in an appropriate container. I've been asked not to suggest what kind of container, but I think you know where I stand on the subject. All right, we've returned from the stove. We made our syrup. We poured it into a very nice decorative mason jar. We're good to go. We have all our ingredients. Let's make this drink. Start with your mixing apparatus. You're gonna need two ounces of white rum. Pour the white rum out of whatever rum container you have into your measure. And keep doing that until you've got two ounces of white rum. Now half a banana and a nice ripe banana is the best for this drink. Put that in there. Now we're gonna muddle or mash or whatever you wanna call it. We're going to eviscerate the banana into the liquid. Just keep muddling until you hardly recognize it as a banana anymore. It's gonna take a while. You might need to take a break halfway through. Now you wanna put in half an ounce of your caramel simple syrup. I'm gonna use my spoon here for precision. Now, obviously, you can put in more or less, depending on your own taste. Obviously, the more you put in there, the sweeter and more rich your cocktail will be. Now, we're gonna shake it in our mixer with ice because we want it to be super cold, and we also wanna mix up that mashed banana real well. Now, as I often like to do, put in a fancy ice cube or ice ball and then strain your drink right on in 
This one is a little thicker than normal. Another good reason to have the ice cube or ball so that all the banana doesn't get hung up in the ice that you have in there. Now a little dash of cinnamon on top. Makes everything nice. Another nice little touch is to put a little bit of that banana on your drink as a garnish. And I'm going to use the fancy toothpick so that it can sit on the outside there. And there you have your banana hanging lounge chair. Let's give it a try. I'm going to take off our garnish. Hmm. That's nice. Strong banana flavor, nice and sweet and rich with that caramel simple syrup. You can also try, if you prefer, a dark spice rum, um, but this doesn't need it. We tried it both ways and we liked it with the white rum. It's kind of a cleaner and more simple approach, but do whatever you want. Still here? It's really awesome of you. Honestly, thank you. If you like what we're doing here, one of the best ways to support us is to simply watch our videos all the way through to the end. Other ways to help us if you like our videos is to literally like our videos by tapping on the like thing. And even more importantly, subscribe to our channel by tapping on the subscribe thing. We humbly hope that you'll share what you found here with every last person you know, and that you'll aggressively demand that they do the same. <laughs> thank you again, and we'll see you next time. I don't know. Maybe we just do something with banana. Can we still spit into a vat? <laughs>